Welcome to a new video of the parts channel, well, answering a question that you have. Left me, I see that there are still doubts about whether to remove the wing nuts or not to remove them from an intake manifold of a BMW, let's see, after having seen so many engines blown because they have swallowed some of the moths, my advice is to remove them, let's see, it also depends on the vehicle. But you can notice that it vibrates a little more especially when it is idling. Because the moths do what they do is to control the air intake especially when the vehicle is idling because when you accelerate the wing nuts are completely open so that all the air flow enters, okay, but well my advice I already say after seeing that is that you remove it. Except of course what is the best option? Well, the one that can afford it every 90 to 100,000 kilometers to buy a new intake manifold and put it on the vehicle, because the wing nuts are not usually, I do not remember any BMW that H I've already swallowed the moths, which I'm not saying there isn't. But I haven't seen any that have swallowed moths with less than 100,000 kilometers. But I already say if you're not one of those who say I'm going to buy a collector every 90 or 100,000 kilometers and I'm going to spend 500 euros, the price is around there, because the ideal would be to remove them but more than anything it is. For the safety of the engine and I already said that I have seen many blown engines and expensive breakdowns of thousands of euros because of that part, with which, having them in the intake manifold already from 100,000 kilometers is not very safe, okay. So that's it or they remove or change the intake manifold, because even if the intake manifold is clean, the wing nuts run out, in the end they end up weakening and sooner or later it will end up swallowing the engine, well, that's where I leave you the video if it has been useful do not forget to give a like and subscribe to the channel.